The whole industry been in shambles. Everybody full gaze. I'm just changing the channel. Yo, let's read between these bars. I got my first membership recommendation. Shout out to my bro, Area Smoke. Appreciate you for becoming a member, bro. Thank you. I'm already booked up for the week. I got another recommendation from Kiki, and I got another recommendation from Brittany, my other two members. Shout out to y'all. Appreciate you. Kendrick Lamar, the people's champion, a man of for analysts. Career damage and verses meditating when candles lit. 2015, Black Friday. Kendrick releases a track over Cole's beat. Cole releases a track over Kendrick's beat. He rapped over All Right. And it was All Right. There was a Once Upon a Time album. I don't know if y'all know about this. It was called Out the Sky. There's not shit on this album other than this little Reddit post, this little blog article that I found, and this video where Kendrick talks about the album himself. Confirmed something. It was probably a moment that killed a collab. J. Cole probably got his almond milk a little too warm and went off and started folding mad towels. Kendrick's like, what the fuck is going on in this fucking Hell, you and Cole got stuff. Can. We got a stash box. A stash box. A, a little stash box. What? What? I mean, listen. I know that we get this question all the time about J Cole collabo mixtape uh -huh. album. Realistically, I mean, you guys aren't recording that stuff for nothing. You know? What no, I'm we're not. We're not. You we're guys not. just gonna surprise us one day? I think that's what it's gonna boil down to. He got, a, he got his album coming right now, which is incredible. He just dropped a single, Miss America. So I know everybody going in a frenzy for that. You know, so we probably got to wait. <laughs> <laughs> that shit ain't never coming out That's what that giggle was That was the fuck I found out how much of a It don't matter We're not gonna get into that But as you can see At one point in time They were talking about collabs Shit was all good They weren't right Cole didn't have to ride a bike He didn't have to go to the beach To find himself He had His spirit was okay They were on some collab shit Wonder what the fuck happened But That was some context Get into the bars. We're gonna get into the most potent ones though. So the song is fucking three and a half minutes long. We ain't gonna go through the whole shit. Pick out little pieces. Slit. Check this. I out. like my raps extra prolific. Some freestyle and no lunch tables and park benches. And I won't mention my ten thousand hours in training while juggling game banking. My balance and was tremendous. And now we look at the competition as quick submissions. They tapping out before we even get a chance to miss them. What this about? Is it money or skill? That was the lamest, like, goofiest shit. And it make, I say all that to say, it made me feel like 10 years ago when I was moving incorrectly. And I pray that God aligned me back up on my purpose and on my path. You know what I mean? I pray that my nigga really didn't feel no way. And if he did, my nigga, I got my chin out. Take your best shot. I'm going to take that shit on the chin, boy. Do what you do. 11 years later from this song and those bars you just heard. How prophetic is that shit, bro? I keep saying it. You can't avoid it. The man is a prophet. Let's just go ahead and just stamp it, kind of. I am. Shit. <laughs> Shit's ridiculous. On stage, apologizing. Had this man praying to God. I owe God for pushing me on the right path. Help me find the right almond milk. Please. Ridiculous, venomous, hate in my heart. The sinister, run for cover. My lineage prove itself. I'm rolling deep in that paper like two Adels. I'm rolling deep in that paper like two Adels. Are you fucking serious, bro? I what? The entendres. The, uh, are you serious? The pen is crazy. J. Cole, he fucked you up on your own beat. Stomped you out. And then you try to come on on All Right and do your little double time flow shit. Man, get that shit out of here. That shit ain't fucking with All Right like the original. This can stomp all over the original. This song, I don't even remember what the fuck it's song is. I'm talking higher power every other hour since Eddie Bowers and stash boxes and lead showers breaking the padlock and the dead coward dying a thousand deaths and tired lions surrounding self with bears watching nigga you share profit. Ah! Higher power since Eddie Bauer. Motherfuckers ain't gonna know what an Eddie Bauer jacket is. Just telling you that he's with the shit. That's it. He's just telling you like, since last showers and coward all of that. Yeah. Then he goes on to say, a lion surrounded by bears. Watch it, you share profit. Who do we know has the illest? I gotta sound like a damn broken record. The illest 360 ever known a man. Who was caught in one? Who was signed to another nigga? Signed to another nigga. They signed to three niggas. Now that's bad luck. Just remember the whole imprint of the pyramid scheme of labels that he was signed to, and then the illest label that he got under Papa Lucy and Grange over there. Fucking, we'll pay for everything on Drake. Drake is. We pay for everything. Specific question about a lyric that I wanted to ask you. So on, on Stay Scheming, Drake says, Tell Lucy and I said, fuck it, I'm tearing holes in my budget. Tell Lucy and I said, fuck it, I'm tearing holes in my budget. Did Drake call you up after that and say, hey, I need more money for my project? When, if ever Drake or whenever Drake calls up and says he needs more money for his project, I give it to him. 
That's that's probably the right. Because he's the greatest. <laughs> well, I fucking beg to differ, good sir. Like I said, though, playing for profit. He got he in the illest 360 ever. You got your pops over here, Pop Lucian. Over here talking about how he gets whatever he wants. Okay, this bro. This is vintage from 1980 some. I'm the son of the pioneer that got you near the sun. Play with him, bitch. You better all voting for Donald Trump. I'm yelling, Mr. Kanye West for president. He probably let me get some head inside the residence. I'm in the White House going all out. Bumping college dropout. God bless Americans. Son of the pioneer that put you on. Don't fuck with Dre. He said it right there. You better all voting for Donald Trump. Well. Unfortunately, homie, I'm gonna go off and blame Kendrick and say that his prophetic words swung the election. Oh no, Kendrick, sometimes I think you just gotta play your bars a little close, bro. Stop saying, stop fucking, don't fuck with the election. All right, you fuck with Drake and all that. Just don't fuck with, you know what I'm saying? Like, don't don't speak prophecy into that. Keep that about here. Nothing more influential than rap music. I merge jazz fusion with the trap music. I mix black soul with some rock and roll. They never box me in, I'm David Blame and now you hoes. Oh yeah. Ain't no boxing in the box in, bro. Yeah, it's from the soul. He does it differently. That's what he's saying. Drake, you can never. You can't. You can't do that, bro. That's that's that shit that he's talking about, though. That's the shit that people don't want to acknowledge. That is acknowledgeable. It's obvious. It's all good. You gotta accept it. It's just fact. Let's go there. My DNA is DMT. I'm so real. My juvenile was wilder than the no yeah. A locomotive couldn't track me down in my co rap. My juvenile was wilder than the no. And then right when he started the verse, he went, Oh yeah, y'all remember that? Oh yeah, chop a style, chop, chop, chop a style, chop a style, chop, chop. They won't chop, chop. They love chop, chop. They won't chop, chop. I don't mean to sound like hurting or something. I need a slim five moment with it. It don't even matter, y'all. Those that remember, you remember, bro. What the fuck was Master P talking about, though? Indonesia, don't tease you. I'm in the biz with a bow-legged beaver. <laughs> fucking stupid as fuck, bro. If y'all remember that song, go listen to it. Can't just perform in this fucking studio, honey. I tell a bitch, don't sweat me. Don't sweat me. I kill it so fucking beat if cold, let me. Please call. Eve should have never sent the instrumental. Every time I start writing, I get sentimental. One of the best I'm better than y'all motherfucker bars that I've ever heard, bro. <laughs> every time I every time I start writing, I get sentimental. Watch the sneak this is though. Beat peep what he says right up after that though. This shit is just not fair. But why the fuck should I care? The story of your life here. Two young stars was born and y'all go die here. Oh Lord, gotta be the yam. Billboard list need Tupac down. But number nine, make sure he lives on. Yeah, Uchi, Gucci, pussies in the trance. I went crazy there, bro, for about an hour. Trying to find the fucking Billboard list where somebody specifically was at number nine. I don't know who he's talking about. 2015, Billboard list is like behind the fucking paywall on Billboard. I ain't paying for that shit. I don't know. I'm assuming he's talking about either Drake or Big Sean. Being as how this was 2015, he was going at these fools. Look at this TDE and my doggies be salivating. Salaries better ratings and casualties all around me. Don't make me do demonstrations. Whoa! Ooh, he's just talking high power shit right there. I ain't even gonna tap into the flow. I'm gonna let him get his shit off because this shit is crazy. Murder my allegations and burning my finger traces and turning my power pages and earning royalty payments. I'm sorry you're not relating. This party is reservated. I kill it so motherfucking beat if J. Cole say it. My nigga each at the instrumental. I gotta slay it. I gotta lay it. Gotta shut your fuckers. I'm not to play with the records and be my favorite. King Kunta, the fucking greatest. Whoa! Kill you on this beating it on royalties off of it. I'm sorry y'all not relating. This party is reservated. Oh my god. He going crazy. That whole verse is crazy though. I had to let that shit play off. Let me know what you think, Black Friday, if you never heard it. Shout out to the homie Ariel Smoke again. Shout out to the homies. Kiki. Brittany. Appreciate y'all. Memberships. If you want, if you want to break down on your own, there, there goes the fucking ladder. I always drop my ladder at the end of these fucking videos. You want to break down on your own? Sign up for the memberships. Music. I got my own little royalty badges I made. I did all the whole little shit. Sign up for the home. Exclusive drops. You gonna hear a little, a little one minute J Cole rant that I cut out of this video because it was a little too crazy. Time starts freeing up a little more. I'm gonna, I'm gonna start doing some song reviews, like random song reviews, funny ass shit that y'all don't remember, and everything that I, I can put as unlisted. That's gonna be for the memberships though. That's gonna be for the homies. Sign up for the homies. I got a bunch of shit planned coming up. Appreciate y'all love. Thought crimes. Shout out to thought crimes. Every video. Love to the homies. Burning my lever. Now it's fun.
need no introduction No ad-libbing my name a hundred times for nothing You already know, it's K-Dot, City of Compton Analogy is like Biggie and bed style, Oakland and Tupac I'm more focused, see I'm nothing like you new guys Y'all struggling over a few lines Thinking you're hot cause your homie said it was a few times Which is too many times a line to you They telling a lie, the only time I line the booth is when I sleep in it Record 24 hours, these niggas better get their bars up See I bench press this rap stuff Got it locked like handcuffs, I threw away the key See my coolest on, she love my AC Jews is on and I wish one of them try to rob me We shoot and have them land between the sheets with the ice leaves We push the coupe like a high speed The helicopters come and realize there's nothing behind us Behind me, your honor I fuck over these beats with no condom This ain't rap, it's really a porno, rewind it back Finally, the finest of them all is back to define the laws of rap Y'all don't obey, y'all ain't nice, y'all just okay You're nothing more than a little John phrase I'm Mike Jordan and it's prime, modern day Isaac Hayes Theme song The Shaft, equivalent to the theme song of your career Follow my craft, you ignorant? I do it without a pen in the pad, just inspiration Something you never had my pockets is something trying to grab See I pull out the rocket and peel you back like scab You old news, you old dudes get out my way Let the young boy come through, don't mention my age I'm on a mission for pay And you astronaut niggas just crowding my space <laughs> okay. Yo, 